Rock stars lined up with classical actors, composers and film directors tonight to pay tribute to the Queen. Hundreds of stars, including the artist David Hockney, Dame Vera Lynn and Lord Attenborough, gathered at the Royal Academy in London. The Queen was presenting five Golden Jubilee Awards to support new talent. Rosie Millard was there. Dame Shirley Bassey was one of the first to arrive for a night which boasted nearly a thousand stars. They came from across the arts world to see the Queen declaring the Royal Academy's new Annenberg courtyard open. After she had given out her £10,000 Jubilee Awards, the party began. In Jubilee year, some 600 artists, musicians and actors, including Shirley Bassey and Joanna Lumley, turned out at London's Royal Academy tonight to celebrate 50 years of the arts. Nina Nana went along. Young hopefuls going through their paces before the start of tonight's celebration of the arts. The event brought together some of the biggest stars in arts and entertainment in Britain, invited to the Royal Academy to meet the Queen. Singers, dancers, musicians, writers, actors, everything wonderful. And to match the Queen, what could be better? Not all the invited guests made it. Mick Jagger and Keith Richards accepted but were notable by their absence. The music world was amply represented, though Mick Hucknall would later reveal the Queen asked him, what do you do? Prince Philip said to me and, and Dame Shirley Bassey, two of my favourite dames here. <laughs> what? A good night, it seems, was had by all. Nina Nana, ITV News. Bye-bye. And just time now for a reminder of our top stories.